Hey, how's it going everyone? I'm DCHG81 and welcome back for another special video and today I'm going to share with you my top 10 best figure in the year of 2023. Like I always say, the year 2023 has been a fruitful year for us collectors which is why I made this top 10 list. So, let's begin. Coming in hot at number 10 is this SH Figuarts Black Adam. Yes, I know the movie is not as good as everyone expected, but to me, I think it's a very enjoyable movie. I kind of like it, and this figure doesn't fail as well. Of course, these two effects parts are from the uh, Mayfax Tor. It doesn't come with this figure, <laughs> so I just put it uh, because it looks rather compatible with the, the original one, which is this one, and he just looks pretty good. And with the addition of this cape, I think it's just a bonus. So I just love him to be inside the cape actually. But with all this effects part, I just have to take it off. But it's very good touch uh, from SHV Quartz. No. And coming in at number 9 is this SHV Quartz Android 19 from the Dragon Ball Z. This is one of my anticipated figure because I just think that they should complete all the Android since they have given us 16, 17, 18 and um, even 21 but they didn't give 19 and 20 yep so this one is like a dream come true and he doesn't fail as well it does come with quite a number of accessories which is great fun to play especially with the broken arms and also he does come with a brain inside to interchange well this guy is packed with accessory and i just can't wait for android 20 to pair with him <laughs> And for number 8 is this Mayfax Jack Snyder Superman. Yes, this is also one figure which I don't believe that they will actually make. And surprisingly, they do. So uh, it doesn't fail because this comes with quite a number of very cool head sculpts. I think they actually improved on the head sculpt itself. Sorry about the focus. Yeah, so you can see that he just looks very good. Wow, this is like a, just like the uh, symbiote Spider-Man that everyone is waiting for. This Now we have a symbiote Superman, which looks very nice. Seven. And for number 7, we do have this SH Figuarts Dragon Ball Z Trunks, the boy from the future. Yes, this is another good upgrade for the very first one yeah so this one just looks <laughs> i just love it because of this head and this hair itself it just comes with a normal base head yeah this looks very good except for a few problems yes uh, the sword actually uh, come out very easily and also the legs also is a bit loose there yeah so uh this is again uh like a dream come true i always hope they actually will do an upgrade on the existing one this is a very good upgrade six Coming in at number 6 is this recently reviewed the Spider-Man 2099 from Across the Multiverse Oh sorry, Across the Spider-Verse Yes, this is another unexpected haul for me because it is very very expensive But nevertheless, I just couldn't resist the beauty of it as you can see It looks very nice with all the great details there, my goodness But he's kind of lacking in terms of the accessory but nevertheless I think this is a very good addition to my Spider-Man family. Yeah, I really can't wait for them to release the Spider-Punk from the SH Figuarts. Five. Number 5, I do have this custom BMS, the Kingdom Come Superman. Wow, this is just a figure that I always wanted ever since I saw the Kingdom Come comic. Yeah, this is very nice. Uh, custom brand, uh, not custom, third party brands uh, they actually make him yeah it's very very nice even though it looks simple but you can see the aesthetic of it is just beautiful especially on the head wow this is nice I just love the feels of the suit just uh, the soft goods is very good so I just hope they make the rest like um, Wonder Woman, Batman from Kingdom Come then it will be perfect yeah some of you guys actually mentioned the a Superman symbol should be bigger. Yeah, I do agree on that, but it doesn't look that bad. Four. And coming in on number four is slightly special because I have this Mayfax Cyborg Superman, and I can't decide whether I should actually include this 
Mayfax steal Superman as well because I just love them both. I mean, just take a look at the aesthetic look. It just looks so beautiful. I just can't make up my mind. So I decided these two actually deserve to be on number four. <laughs> And for number 3, we do have the SH Figuart Spider-Gram from Across the Spider-Verse. Yeah, this figure is just very nice. I just love it a lot, especially on the beautiful head. You can see they capture her lightness just off the screen. It's so perfect looking. My goodness. Yeah, so I, and she can also pose very well. Just love this figure a lot. This is definitely one of the SH Figuart's best. And on number 2, we do have this SH Figuarts, the Tobey Maguire Spider-Man or they call it the Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man. Yes, i just been waiting for this guy since I watched the movie maybe around 20 years ago, I think. Yeah, this is just perfect. I mean, it looks like just come out from the movie. Yeah, and the best thing is they even give two... Toby Maguire hates, yeah, that's just beautiful. I mean, this figure is a must have if you are a big fan of Spider Man. And the first place is also very special because I do have this Mayfax Terminator, and of course, I can't resist to place this Mayfax Terminator to better damage on the spot as well because I just love both of them. I love Terminator. But I think um, Terminator 2 is still my favorite. Of course, there's another clean version of this T800, which I haven't gotten my hands on it. I believe he will be right over here if I have it on hand as well. So there'll be three in my number one spot. Okay, so I would like to add another three figure, which I think is worth mentioning. So let's check them out. And coming in on number 3 is this Marvel Legends Black Widow and the reason why I think she's worth mentioning is because she just comes with 3 different head sculpts that you can interchange so buying one of these Black Widow is like you're getting 3 different Black Widow with lots of different accessory and smokes effects it's just so cool so many things that you can play with for this Black Widow so if you are into a classic Black Widow this is one that you shouldn't miss and for number 2 is this SH Figuarts Andrew Garfield Spider-Man. Wow, I just love this guy. He can easily be in the same spot as Tobey Maguire in the top 10. But unfortunately, I drop him out because he doesn't come with any head scope of uh, Andrew Garfield. That's pretty disappointing. If they were to give only one, I'm not greedy. I'm not asking for two. I only ask for one head scope of Andrew Garfield. He can reclaim his space in my top 10 yeah it just looks beautiful just look at all the paints that is on him my goodness i know some of you guys say that he does looks like he have a long neck but trust me guys when you're placing him on action poses dynamic poses it's not even that obvious so this guy is definitely a good pick and coming in on number one spot is this up and rising jada toys the street fighters yes this brand is actually on the hype now yeah they're becoming like a you know a trend yeah their their figure is very affordable is slightly cheaper than marvel legends yet you can see their quality is so good and they are actually making even more and more characters from the street fighter so if you are into street fighter gaming this is one that you should really collect because they are really affordable once again and their articulation is not that bad and you can see the the facial expression all is pretty good yeah these are really really something that i'm really looking forward because i want to build all my street fighter characters yeah this is the one that i think you shouldn't really miss Okay guys, so these are my top 10. <laughs> yes, I know it doesn't look like top 10 anymore because it's more than 10 figures here. But these are just very nice. I mean, I love them all. And I do hope that you do agree with me in some of my selections. And I definitely hope that this year will be even better. So once again, I do appreciate you watching my top 10. And I'll catch you guys again in my next video.